What's up, y'all? It's your boy Lee. I'm the YouTube coolest South African geek. Welcome to my channel. Like if you like my review. Subscribe if you're not subscribed to the channel. Do me a favor. Just hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Let's dive right in. This is Netflix original movie. Um, dude, it was a really fantastic movie. It's a coming of age story, mostly focused on these four girls' relationships and the tragedy that unfolds them. Basically, I'm gonna give you that's the summary of the movie and how they grow from that as individuals mostly because they try to escape the pain in a sense pretend like it never really happened but it did happen and it was kind of evident I, re I really enjoyed uh lucy hale i think that's what her name is performances lily she was amazing and the dude who played thomas his death reminded me of the cancellation of shinara chronicles because i really enjoyed that dude and his character and that whole show it was just an amazing show uh, but that's sidetracking um alexandra was also amazing like the whole dynamic as the group were it was amazing like the casting was perfect for this like a lot of things were normal in this show in this movie which i appreciated like drug use like it is our reality in a sense not that i, I promote drug use but i'm just saying it is normal to some generation a lot of scenes take place in cars in this movie um and and the backyard of lily's house that was a, also a key moment in this movie uh the mother the, the shocking moment was the mother where she was there seeing them smoke and she was so happy and just giggly and saying ah these are my kids but she was a single mother she was doing the best she could do uh one of my st standout character and this whole thing was Noah, uh, played by Alex Wolf. I think that's what his surname is. He's brother of Nate Wolf, I think, from Paper Towns and Dead Note. Yeah, he's his character stand out for me. I related to that character more. Goofy, very likable, nice guy, who doesn't want to have the nice guy routine so he could get the girl. I wish I had the boss to do what he did though, when he just went for the kill with the kiss. That was a killer moment. Uh, the the chick, the Asian chick, I think her name was Rebecca, right? If I'm not mistaken, the name was Rebecca, right? Uh, she had a lot of risque scenes, especially with her teacher. Uh, Chloe's character, I understand she was in pain, but there was some questionable moves she did, like lying to Lily. I know Lily was overbearing, but she can't expect Lily to to react the way she did when she knew Lily was going to react the way she did. That's why she was there, like, didn't tell Lily the full story, what school she was going to go to. So I was surprised that, and the fact that she read the letter, but she was like, yo, he was my blood, so you shouldn't miss Thomas the way you miss Thomas. I was like, what? Damn, that was so harsh to Lily, but I felt like she needed that to grow as a person, like. Her character growth needed that moment. Like everybody against us, she needed it. Another <laughs> classic moment when the dog ate all the breath mints. I really wanted to see how they would act out the dog being high. Uh, like, I, like I said, a lot of car scenes in this movie. Like the moment where Lily picks up her sister and find out the brother played a cruel trick on him. He was also another character. His wit, I really wish I could like show people the witty side of me and this character totally like embody that like my introversial side lets the wit stay in here you know what i'm saying and his character like one of the best lines is when he said uh, i can't wait until i'm a mom yo that's already left in with that dress that was a funny moment also when no one lily finally did i was like get it no he was down there for like 11 minutes get it no Noah's ex was funny. She she was crazy. I, I understand it. The, the infatuation of crazy girls. So that, that's why I was like, I'm so Noah. Um, let's talk about what's his name again. Uh, Mike. The Mike situation. Like they make a lot of moments that are normal, normal. But I feel like this shouldn't be normal. That like a girl should go through such a traumatic event and just shake it off. Like uh, it's just a, a jerk guy, and that's what. Lily's character did. Oh man, it's just not cool. 
I just really hated that moment so much. Because uh, Rebecca and the teacher did end up together and it was such a normal thing. Like as soon as she was 18, it was like, that's life, yo, Tiger and Kylie. <laughs> uh, Noah and um, Lily end up together, which obviously got to me. I already enjoyed that moment. I mean, like this ultimately was rooted from Thomas's death. And it was a great love story from Thomas's death to Lily moving on with Noah, you know what I'm saying? I really enjoyed this movie. I give this movie an 8 out of 10. Definitely going to watch it. It's one of those coming of age stories that are timeless now for me, at least. Uh, uh, I advise you, if you haven't watched it, to go watch it. Uh, deuces. Like if you like my review. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed to my channel. Yeah.